Hey, what's going on? Ryan here with Intersection Records, and we are talking album reviews this morning and the new album from England's Royal Blood. Royal Blood was formed in 2011 in West Sussex, England, and Worthing. And uh, they're a duo now. Uh, it's bass, distorted bass that sounds like guitar and drums. And um, there's some keys. Uh, it's excellent rock music, uh, kind of contemporary rock. They've got four records out. This record came out September 1st, and it's called Back to the Water Below. Some sort of jellyfish on there. This is a really cool record. <clears throat> you know, I saw this band back in 2015, open up for some uh, band at a shed here in St. Louis. And remember thinking, hey, they're pretty cool. Uh, you know, I've wanted to get into the records, to be honest, I haven't, but this follows up 2021's Typhoons, and I like this record quite a bit. Uh, this band is led by Mike Kerr on, on bass and vocals. He also plays synths and piano and some guitar. Uh, and drummer Ben Thatcher, <clears throat> you know, they're really running as a duo. He's a, he's a drummer. Keys, bass are provided by, by uh, Kerr. And let's get into this thing, Mountains at Midnight. You know, just kind of edgy, powerful. Again, the bass has a, a fuzz effect on it, a distortion, and you could easily uh, confuse it for guitar. It works that way. Kerr's voice is excellent. You know, he does a falsetto thing at times. He's, he's not afraid to take chances and, and do some you know swirling things with his voice. I really like Mountains at Midnight. Uh, Shiner in the Dark is, is maybe my favorite song, or one of them. Uh, it's poppier, um, just hooky. Again, he's using a falsetto. Still has the edge of the first song, but just more dreamy and poppy. And, and I, you know, again, I'm a little late to the party on these guys, and I'm kind of embarrassed that I am. I want to go back through. The fact they're playing here next week, uh, but I'll be in Los Angeles uh, reviewing the Crossroads Guitar Festival. By the way, subscribe to my channel if you haven't. I, I, I do shows. I try to do shows every single day. I, I, I'm getting back to my, my album reviews because I've been so busy lately. Shiner in the Dark is great. Uh, one of my favorite tracks, uh, and this, and, and, and Kerr, Mike is one of the best vocalists in rock, in my opinion. Pull Me Through is next. It's a piano-based song. Got a little Beatles thing going on. You know, I want you to pull me through. I mean, there's, <clears throat> we're going to talk about that a little bit. I, I, I don't know, does anybody else hear like a Beatles sensibility? Pull Me Through is great. Firing Lines, another one of my favorites. Got and when I compare bands to other bands, I'm, I'm not being critical. There, I hear ELO here. I hear Radiohead. It's sexy. It's got a sexy vocal. The lyrics are great. I love the piano by Kerr here. It's a fantastic song. Uh, Tell Me When It's Too Late. You know, again, that fuzzy bass tone. Just really cool on this record. Uh, Triggers is next. You know, Backbone shake, you know, to kind of use a blues reference. You know, they're, they're 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 bluesy in a sense, but boy, it really works. And even on the second listen of this record, I've listened to this four or five times now. You feel like you already know these songs, which is a good sign. Balance with pop sensibility. How many more times? You know, maybe a little bit weaker on on track seven. Strong enough though. High Waters, great vocals, great delivery. Again, I'm going to keep saying that's about Mike Kerr. He's a new favorite vocalist of mine. He's fantastic. Um, we really get going. Get with there goes my cool. Got this piano Beatles thing going on, and that's a good thing, obviously. Um, you know, again, I wrote I have a new band to check out here. Check out their back catalog. Really like this. Really like this band. And then maybe my favorite song of the year, a song called Waves. I'm going to read some lyrics here if I don't screw this up. But where do we go? What would it take if you ever find me falling away? Uh, don't let me choke like I'm nothing to save. If you ever lose me, dive under the waves. It's just great 
you know, it's, it's about a relationship clearly where, you know, we all get lost. Sometimes we get selfish. I just connect with these with with these voc with these vocals and 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 you know I I don't care about lyrics like a lot of people do as much I love music but if I can pick up a little sense of what he's talking about I really dig it I uh, you know again this is their fourth record back to the water below um, here's my rating system five is a drop dead classic perfect four is great three is good two is not good one is terrible this is a four and a quarter. This is better than great. It's not perfect. Um, slags a little bit in the middle, but there's some really strong songs here. Check out my channel. Check out Royal Blood's new record. Uh, this is fantastic. Peace out. See you.